Let's have a closer look at this strainer. Up here at the top of the strainer, you might have noticed that we have two O-rings and they are there for a very good reason. The fact is uh, when O-rings are in CO2, they will have a different size when they're taken out of CO2 again. They simply become deformed a bit, but no worries. They will get back to the original shape after a few hours. Therefore, we suggest that you, in a service situation, you use the two O-rings we have here. The smallest O-ring you put here for the outlet, the bigger O-ring you put up here for the connection uh, to the ejector block. The two O-rings you have removed, you make sure to put up here on the top of the ejector. They will be back to the normal size after a few hours in normal atmosphere, uh, and they will be ready for you when you do the next service operation. So in that way, it's a very uh, easy to do service. Let's have a closer look at the strainer itself. You simply dismount it by starting here to remove the bottom of the strainer. It is quite easy. You, of course, will have dirt uh, that you have to take care of uh, if it was in operation. The way you do it is you make sure to have uh, CO2 or air or nitrogen or something and you blow it clean. After you have cleaned it, you have a very good look at it. You will see there is very nice reinforced mesh in the center of it. And you will see on the outside there is like a finer layer of mesh. So all, of all in all, it is a very robust strainer that is protecting your system. So when you have done service and you have cleaned it, please with your own eyes, have a look and make sure the strainer is intact. Because it is very important that it is in order to protect the multi ejector system. If it is not intact, you need to go ahead and order yourself a new service kit on our website. Always remember to clean the strainer after 24 hours of operation, so during startup. Because a lot of dirt uh, might come into the system there and it's very important that we get it cleaned and get it out of the system. If necessary, Remember to repeat this operation until the, clean, the strainer remains clean and you will be secured very good performance of the ejectors. So all in all, make sure to take good care of your strainer. Then you will also have a great ejector system running.